This is the Big Whitley SL26. The Sea Legend is a popular, big, luxurious sports fisher come cruiser capable of tackling the big stuff head on and bringing you home in complete comfort and safety. But it's a quality product and second to none on features. The Whitley Sea Legend was a real surprise package for me. I've only ever been in their cruisers, so um, it's, a, it's a really, really nice boat. And a rocket ship, it just goes like, uh, goes like the flappers. This was the only boat in the Australia's Greatest Boats competition for 2012 to have a full stand-up head. It's a big cabin space with all the trimmings of home, including a toilet and shower ensemble. It's got proper bunks and a full galley, a fridge and storage to boot. This is a boat you can actually take on a long trip for a night or two without fuss and still have a shave in the morning. It's that good. Now, um, what's quite unique with this boat is that it has been designed to suit fishing as well as cruising. So um, there's a lot of luxury involved in it, a lot of finer sort of touches. The helm is what you would expect of such a big boat. It's got a nice seating position with a big armchair and a well thought out dash too. Everything is within easy reach, and in the case of this test boat, there was no room for anything else. There was options aplenty. It's the upspec boat we've driven today. It's, it's kind of like the big family cruiser, but it drives like a Bathurst race car. An unusual blend of fishing boat and cruiser. Take two steps back and you're in the heart of the action. Fishing Mecca. It's just lovely and comfortable. The family's going to be happy, you know, two kids go camping, go water skiing, go and do a bit of fishing, go and do a barbecue, chuck some outriggers on it, go 30 miles offshore and catch a mile on the next day with the boys. Whitley, Sea Legend, great boat. The Whitley SL26's size comes into its own with a massive rear deck. Perfect for all sorts of fishing, this thing gives you plenty of workspace. They're a good big boat, it's eminently fishable, it's got a great big deck space on it, self-draining deck, there's enough rod holders for 15 or more rods, both in transit and while the action's on. That bait board is a perler. It's got nice runoff, it's sturdy, and it's got a big secure drawer for all the rigging tackle right underneath. There's a very cool black live bait tank with a light to keep the fish happy, and centrally located large kill tanks to top off those good days on the water. So now you can sit back on the comfy seats and enjoy the drive home. No issues when it comes to performance. You can knock down the hammers and that thing flies. The drive home will be a ripper too. This test boat was a customer's boat and he'd done it right. The SL26 was fitted with a massive 350 horsepower Yamaha V8. It rumbled along at a cracking pace, which the big Whitney just ate up. The bigger the seas, the better this thing seemed to go. It turns well at speed, it cuts the chop with ease, and it can smash off the top of some pretty big waves like Mike Tyson shakes off a punch for the face. Our storage absolutely everywhere, and of course nobody finishes a boat like the Whitley. Their timber work, their mouldings are all beautiful. This is a big, bold, luxury fishing boat that really means business.